Welcome back to the Gun Collective. My name is John Patton, and this is the Quarantine Gun Show. Guy Shot Show is in quarantine this year. You know, things are a bit strange. So what we've done is decided to get with some of our favorite manufacturers of all kinds of stuff and bring you guys the latest and greatest that they are offering. Today, we're looking at stuff from our friends at Coltac. Now, you've seen Coltac on TGC for years now, absolutely been a great partnership with them they've been supporting us for a long time we use a lot of their gear and they make everything from suppressor covers ammo books for competition guys support bags i particularly love their boss bag for uh, rifle shooting and today they've got some some stuff that's a little bit different than that and we're just going to take a look at it up here we've got one of the three colors we've got a a color down here this is a black and like gray with the orange this is a multicam black i believe I don't know, multicam is like 800 different versions. Again, with the orange Coltac on there. And then we have this sort of coyote tan, all with the black bottoms. So this is called the Grocery Getter. And the idea with this is to be sort of an all-purpose bag. This is sort of a bag you can just throw in the car, have at home, whatever, and literally either use for groceries, you can carry around a case of ammo. It's fantastic, and I think it's really neat. Uh, on the on the outside of the bag on this side they've got of course a patch panel if you want to throw something offensive on there that's great then you've got your key hook here you know you could throw everything from a key to I don't know a range tag like if you use this for a range bag you could throw your membership card at your local club things like that uh, these are all reinforced stitching I think they call this the infinity X pattern uh, of stitching to make sure that this is not going anywhere and you can carry all kinds of stuff They've also got the molly webbing on the outside, you know, so you can uh, I don't know I would probably throw a med kit or something like that on the outside of here I think that's a great idea med kits are rad flipping it around to the other side again nice straps and we've got this huge pocket here for uh, I don't know carrying, a, you know, if you want a candy bar you get a little Snickers once in a while, something like that. That might be a great idea. Or you can, I don't know, throw something healthy in there like kale, uh, if you want to be that kind of guy. Uh, the, the real thing that I think is interesting, we've got a shadow systems in there. I don't know how that got in there. Uh, that's the DR920. So here's what's cool. I, you guys have probably seen peeks at this as I'm fidgeting with it. The entire inside is this super bright, like blaze orange color. There's no pockets in here. It's just wide open. And the idea, with this is so that no matter what the lighting conditions are, you can actually see what's in the bag down in like the deepest, darkest corners because you know, uh, as well as I do, some bags just eat gear. Like there's stuff just buried in corners, ammo just tucked away in areas that you just can't see. And the idea with this is to be able to see all of that. It's also great, uh, you know, if you wanna signal down somebody and say, hey, I need more groceries. I'm kidding, that's not what that's for at all. But uh, we, again, we've got the Coyote Tan, the black, and we, I think this is Multicam Black. It might be some other version of that. I don't know. But uh, these are pretty cool. The price tag on these lands at uh, 50 for the sort of plain colors and then an extra five bucks, 55 bucks for the Multicam series. So that's pretty cool. That's something new and different. Oh, and I forgot to mention as I'm whacking this on the bottom. So this is 500D. Kedura up, up top, and then they've got water resistant 1050D Kedura. I don't even know what the ratings mean. This is water resistant on the bottom, and that's great. There we go. Let's get that out. What's in here? Is there a treat in here? Just a battery. It's not special. All right, let's put that over there. Now, we've got some other cool stuff here. You can see this one's got some shite in it. Uh, this is their new suppressor bag. And the idea behind this is that a lot of NFA guys really like, you don't just end up with one can, you end up getting a whole bunch. And these are built to hold eight suppressors, eight of them safely. Got a little fuzz in there. So it's, it's a really simple concept. A bunch of pouches across here, eight of them in fact, and they fold up so that, uh, I don't know if you guys can see that well, I'll try to hold it in the light so that they don't like uh, mat match up with each other and just smash into each other. They kind of set uh, separate from each other. They, they kind of go interweave like a zipper almost. And that's cool, that's a great idea. And then you've got pouches on the inside. You wanna throw some paperwork, uh, things like that. The, the ideas that I had uh, for this would be almost like if you had, if you didn't have like eight cans, cause you know, for some people that's a fair amount, you know, NFA guys that are like enthusiasts really get into it. But 
for somebody that doesn't have more than like a couple cans, this might be great for throwing like maybe some wire pulling gel, a couple tools, things like that in here. And, and it's really just a simple thing. Again, the patch panel, I'll show you guys that way. So it's not facing me. So again, a patch panel and it's zipper closure. Let's get that, I'll just show you. Yeah, zipper closure, really, really simple. And huge straps for when it gets heavy. I'll show you how we've got one set up. We just threw this together today. This is the regular multi-cam and then we've got the sort of coyote tan. Man, that's got some weight to it because there's cans in there. So these, we've got a, a menagerie of cans. I'll go through and show you because this will be fun for you guys. All right, so in here, we've got a Bowers Group War Dog with a three lug attachment. That's cool. I don't, I don't even know what's in here. This is the ASP 45 from Bowers Group. That's a direct thread 45 that weighs like nothing. You can throw that around. That's cool. We actually had that one on the Banshee. This was on the MP5 or SP5. Then in here, this is a Bowers 30T. That one's cool. We like that one a lot. That does great. Empty slot for unknown reasons. And then we've got a Bowers was this a Verse 9S? I thought this was a 458. This is a Verse 9S. I promise this is not a Bowers ad. I did not intend on having this one. Then we've got this wacky thing. This is a, from NG2 Defense. It's the MaxFlow 3D. I think this is the 30 cal version. So this is a this is something that uh, I don't I don't know if these had like big commercial success. Honestly, I don't even know if the company's still around. But we've got the direct thread model, and it's got some crazy venting. It's something. Totally different. Uh, they were pretty expensive, I do remember that. And then one of my favorite cans, this is the YHM Resonator. It's just standard resonator, not the K. And this is my favorite in the 30 cal, or one of my favorites, I should say, because it's affordable. So that's a cool can. And boop, there you go. Throw it in there, close her up. If I can get the zipper to align properly, there we go. And that's that, okay, so. Those are cool. Now this one over here, the Coyote Tan, I believe is 70 bucks retail. And then we've got five more dollars again for the Multicam. I don't know if a lot of people know this. I'll, I'll tell you guys a little industry insider thing. Multicam costs money, like extra money. You have to like license it to be able to sell it. It's kind of silly. So the fabric always costs more. So if you ever see like a Multicam product and you're like, man, that's expensive. It's because they actually charge more money for the pattern being on the fabric. Now, I'm not saying that's out of line. I'm just saying that is what it is. So again, 70, 75, uh, this is 55 for the Multicam here. And then the plain, more plain colors are 50 bucks. And that's it from Coltac this year, guys. Uh, you know, again, we really enjoy a lot of their products. So I definitely think you guys should go check them out. If you guys are enjoying the quarantine gun show stuff, please get subscribed. Click the links down below to see all of the new and cool stuff. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. And as always, thank you all for watching. We'll see you soon.